all right guys so today's video is about how to connect smart bracelet to iphone so let's get down to business the first thing to do here is to switch on your bluetooth your data and location so here is my wi-fi or data my bluetooth is switched on and i'm going to go to my settings and go to privacy and make sure my location service is switched on the next thing to do is to download fit pro app download fit pro app from apple app store and get it installed on your iphone and you are going to see this fit pro so download this and open it now we are going to connect one of our smartwatches here so how do you connect it now you go to the setting option on the dashboard and you select that you are going to see options that come up select this bind device to experience more feature and you select that it's going to bring out your smart bracelet name as you can see I have two smart bracelets here, that is why it is showing LT716 and 716. Okay, so it will be one of these two. To know that, you have to go to your settings and check that. So I'm going to connect just one of it. And you can see Bluetooth pairing request, select pair. And it's going to pair up. This is a message saying Fit Pro wants to use your location. Select change to always allow. Okay. I've connected one of our smart bracelets here, which is this. So we are going to select allow for notifications to come in. And now we have our smart bracelet connected. Select the find option to confirm it is connected. As you can see, it vibrates. Okay, that means it is connected. Now, the next thing to do here is if you want to do message push option like this, you want to get WhatsApp messages, go to your message push option settings here. And make sure you have these options turned on most especially the whatsapp option so i'm going to select call reminder toggle it on sms reminder toggle it on if you want wish out and quick queue reminder select that for facebook toggle for twitter toggle and for whatsapp toggle it on and instagram toggle it on so those are the social notifications that you can have on your smart bracelet so once you are done you can go back other settings, if you want to do, that is, if you want to change your watch face, you can come to these dice settings. Select dice settings and wait for it to load up. It's going to load up the dice settings. This is the default dice settings, which we can see right here. Okay. So now you can select this option here saying recommend. When you select that, you have a lot of wallpaper to choose from. You can scroll all the way down to pick anyone that fascinates you. So once you see one that you want to pick, select it this way and select synchronize. When you select synchronize, it's going to come to your smartwatch face. Okay. You can also pick any of this style. That is the time placement. As you can see, you can pick any of them. And once you are okay with it, select synchronize style. And it's going to come on your smart bracelet. Now, if you want to use your own wallpaper that means your own picture just come to this option like this any option at all you can pick any of this wallpaper just pick one of it and select replace when select replace it's going to ask you fit pro wants to access your photos select allow access to all photos and you can pick any of your photos so i'm going to pick this dog photo now you can shrink in okay I'm going to leave small space for time here. When you are okay with it, select done option down and you can see your dog here. So now I want to make this time to come here. So I'm going to pick this one as you can see, and I'm going to select synchronize. You can see a prompt message that pop up. So we are going to select done for it, select done. And you can see loading and on our watch, it is showing something uploading. So let's just wait for it to sync up and upload completely now we have update success right on our smart bracelet you can see a beautiful watch there so it's looking nice this is our dog if you have any question please drop it down there in the comment section and that is all for this video see you on the next one bye peace